Okay, today I want to talk about the ACT Customer Management Database software uh, provided by Sage. Uh, I had on my old system, on my system with the XP on it, I had ACT 2003. It's also known as ACT 6.0 or 6.0. Now, when I got me a new computer with the Windows 7 operating system on it, mine's actually 64 bit. I went to install it on this computer and it would not work. It was incompatible. I even run the uh, uh, combat compatibility tool that's in the Windows control panel and that still didn't solve the problem. I had over 3,000 business contacts in my database which could be you know exported out to like Excel or whatever but I'd lose all the functionality that I had with my program. So what I'm going to do is because I Wrote to set my blog. I posted the screen pics and all on my blog. I'm just going to read from the blog. Let's install the Act 6.0 or Act 2003 on your computer, okay? So it's Act 6.0, Act 2003 can be installed on the Windows 74 or 7 64-bit system. I say Act 2003 and Act 6.0. They are in fact the same edition of Act, just by two different names. If you're like me, a small business owner, and using Act 2003 by Sage Software, and you have the Windows 7 64-bit operating system, and you tried to install Act, you ran into a compatibility issue. Act 2003, Act 6.0 would not install. You have may try. You may you may have tried the Windows compatibility tool in the control panel, and found that it does not fix the problem either. Furthermore, you went to Sage's website and read this statement: Windows 7 only Act 2010 and later versions are supported on this operating system OS. At first glance, this leads you to believe you will not be able to use your current Act 6.0 Act 2003 version of the software on your computer. This also leads you to believe that if you do not buy the latest version, up, the upgrade prices do not apply unless upgrading from Act 2011 or later, that you won't be able to access your contacts in the Act program that you have grown accustomed to. In my case, I have over 3,000 contacts on my version of Act, and I want to keep everything as is. So what options do you have? Option number one, you can install Act 6.0, Act 2003. You can ignore the incompatibility message and follow the instructions I'm about to give you here and install Act 2003, Act 6.0 on your Windows 7 64-bit system, or you can go with option number two. What Sage failed to mention, because they want you to buy more software, is this. Only the setup menu when you click Setup EXE or run autoplay from the root directory on the CD is incompatible. Just the setup menu. The program itself works just fine. And here is the uh, picture from the CD itself. When you stick the CD in, you get the option for autoplay or open folders. I open the folder. And if you see, this is the root directory here. You see setup. You see the autoplay right there in the root directory. Okay. So what now? The solution is very simple. You don't need to be a rocket scientist, computer programmer, network administrator, nor a software engineer to install Act 6.0, Act 2003 on your Windows 7 computer. All you need to do is open Act 6. Point, open the Act 6.0 folder on the CD and click Setup EXE and let it run. Enter your serial number and you are good to go. Back up your ACT database on your old system and simply import import that database into your ACT program on a new system. It really is that simple. Notice here to, to your left is the original when you open up the files from the CD. The ones I had the red arrow showing the autoplay and set up above. You notice I got the uh, ACT 6 folder selected. I opened that up on the window on your right. If you look all the way down on the bottom, I got three red arrows pointing at it. There's the setup EXE. You just simply click that setup right there let it run it's going to ask you for your serial number and a little bit of registration information stuff and just do what it asks and then and then you're good to go and then you'll just import uh your database uh that you had backed up you just import opens up and you maintain all the customization like me i have put a lot of time into customizing the actual forms that are inputted you know, highly customize that i have a uh, email graphical email messages all kinds of stuff that i did not want to lose and i was just so glad i found a way to do this i found it on the internet somewhere i don't remember where but i found it but i thought i'd talk about it option number two you can export your contacts 
on your old system into a format such as tab delimited XLS etc and import your contacts into a, a program that you have such as Excel if you do that you'll like I said you'll lose all your customization of your contact screens your note history all sorts of stuff that will only work in act so upgrade will be an option if you're so inclined if this has helped you leave a comment let me know cheers have a good day